Hello rugby fans and welcome back to the channel. Today I have episode number three of my Six Nations playthrough as England on EA Sports Rugby 23. Now in the first two episodes, if you missed them, we suffered a disappointing defeat to Scotland first up at Murrayfield, but we come back with a bang and a victory against Italy and the standings, every single team has won one and lost one, so it's all to play for. Today we are at home again against the mighty Wales in a blockbuster matchup. So before we get into it, please do drop a like if you enjoy this content. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of this series and how are we going to do. Can we take home that Six Nations trophy? And if you haven't already, please do move that subscribe button. Now, of course, as you know, this is a modded version of the old EA Sports Rugby 08 game. I have got a tutorial video on my channel if you want to know how to download these mods and get your game looking like mine does. But here we go, another evening matchup at Twickenham, and this is going to be a humongous game. The Welsh have come to town. And there's Owen Farrell. Not changing any of the stardom 15. We stick with the realism. Like I said, England have announced their team for the first real-life Six Nations game against Scotland. So we're going to try and keep it true to that if we can. Dan Bigger, Josh Adams, some quality, quality players for Wales. And like I said, we're on Elite. We're on the highest difficulty. My controller is not ideal. As you saw in the Scotland game, we did a bit better against Italy. Started to get to grips with the funky controls. But this is going to be a real, real test today. Let's, let's go deep. I don't really ever go deep. But let's go for a big, deep kick and try to get some early pressure on the Welsh. And instantly, Dan Bigger has relieved that pressure. Hassel Collins has got the ball. Don Brandt barging through. Lovely stuff from Don Brandt. Lewis Ludlam barging through. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. I like this. Lovely handoff to Don Brandt. Yep, we're making some waves. The whiskey barging through. He's gone through two players. The camera cannot keep up. Now Itoji's barging through. Ah, oh, no. They've won it back, haven't they? Box kick. Elliot Daly's got it back. Whiskey again. Oh, Sinclair barging through. Our forwards doing a lot of good work currently. Ludlam out to Hassel Collins. No one there to pass it to. Smith's down. We've still got the ball. Get rid of it. Charge. Dombrant. Barging through. Getting so, so close now. Ludlam. So close to the try line. It's got to be happening now. Youngs, you passed it to no one. Offloads galore from Wales, clearing their lines. Ah, how disappointing was that? Not sure what happens here. I think the ball is unplayable in the ruck. It's a Welsh player down. What a start so far. Early substitution for Wales. Scrum time. Come on, Genge, George, Sinclair, and the boys. Put in from Ben Youngs. Yes, we have got this. Or have we? No, they've turned it on their heads. The ball is out. What's happened here? Was it a knock-on? 
Yes, knock on again. We're going to get a second chance. Let's try again, boys. Yes, we've got it again. Here we go. Smith. Hassel Collins. Back inside. Come on. Great to a whiskey. Jamie George. Farrell. Hassel Collins, go down. No, he's not over the line. Ludlam. What has happened now? I mean, from here, let's just tap it. Come on, we're right on the line. I'm not sure what's happened there. Maro Itoji. Ah, oh, what is going on? Get it out this side. Pick it up. Ben Youngs. Inside. Malin. So, so close. We need to make this pressure pay. Don Brandt. Can't get down. Malins, we're going backwards. Where's the forwards? Genge. What has happened now? We've got another penalty. Right. This is unfathomable pressure on the Welsh. Farrell here. Oh, God. Can't even really see where we're kicking. Here we go then. 30 minutes are already on the clock. Oh, what's happened here? Oh no, was the throw not straight? Penalty to Wales. Cool, look straight to me. And after all that, we haven't got anything to show at all for that dominance. Bigger gets rid of it. Malins has picked it up and he's taken it into touch. Poor from Malins. Nicely won. Youngs, Malins, Farrell. Back inside to Itoji. Right. What can we do here before half time? Malins is on the attack again. Straight into a... Ah, they've turned it over on the 22. Ben Curry trying to charge down bigger, but he's got it to touch. That was probably a mistake on our part. It is. They've turned it over, or have they? Hands in the ruck again, perhaps? Farrell has got the boot on again. Can we do something incredible there? Oh! Yes, I think we have. I think Faz has nailed an absolute peach. Or has it gone to half time? I know we were cutting it fine there, but it looked like that went into touch fine. Well, I cannot believe that first half. If we somehow don't win this game, we will look back on that. Terrible stuff. Big high kick from Bigger. And it's gone straight to Reese Samet. Luckily, we have won the ball back. Smith with the big kick. In the touch. Are they going for a quick one? They are. And they've knocked it on. Advantage to England. See what we can do. Malins. Barrel breaking through. Can we have the advantage? Yep. Knock on. Scrum time again for England. And we've won it back again. 
Youngs. Have some Collins. Forwards. Can we have some forwards? And again. Don Brandt making up some ground. So Collins, low off the mark. Whiskey, come on, we're building pressure again. Sinclair, straight down on the floor. Ah. Marchants cannot take bigger down, and they've kicked to touch again. Ah, and they've beat one. Our line out. Bigger. Lovely charge down. What's happened? Where's the ball? We've got it. So Collins. Let's go. Blind side. Quick. Toji. Go on, son. Get in there, Marrow. Lovely turn of foot from Marrow. He's got us over the line. Finally. The pressure is paid. The boys are celebrating. Wales' hearts are broken, finally. Maro Otoji goes down. Now we've got a big kick. Incoming. From the skipper. Ooh. No, terrible. Terrible, terrible kick. And he's not happy with himself. We have still got 23 minutes on the clock. Good jump this time from a whiskey. See if we can get this more rolling. Lovely stuff. Keep it going, boys. Young's just got it now. Out to Smith. Back to Young's. Ah, oh, terrible. Why? Where are the forwards? Oh, I'm not sure what's happened there, but it's an advantage to Wales. Palatal, huge tackle. I think Smith knocked it on when he was looking to uh, looking to kick. Great tackle from Farrell. Surely the advantage is over now. Gotta be. Knock on. Scrum time to Wales. Now this is a big moment. Lovely tackle. Yes. Get it away properly this time, Smith. Still can't find touch. Off. Get him off. Get him off the pitch. Yes, we got the ball back. Whew. Hassel Collins with a big kick. Not quite in the touch. But a good tackle from him as well. We are one converted try away from losing this game. Barrel with a heave. Get Josh Adams in the touch. Not there. Tom Brandt with a kick. Lovely tackle by Farrell. Right, 80 minutes are up. Ah, oh, 
lovely from Smith. Come on. Get it out, Ben Youngs. Russell Collins into the stands. England have won again. Whew. I was on the edge of this on the edge of my seat for most of that game. Really, really hard work that was. Very enjoyable, very fun to play. And England are now two wins on the bounce. Beaten Wales at home. And yeah, a fantastic performance. Let's get ourselves off to the tournament central. See how the rest of the teams are doing. So we look at the fixtures. So what have we got this time? One, two, three. So England have beaten Wales. France have just edged Scotland. Ireland have thrashed Italy. Ireland have then beaten Wales. Scotland have beaten Italy. So we've got a game in hand. But it's looking like Ireland are the team to beat at the minute. Here we go. So if we were to beat France, it would be a heads-up game against Ireland for the Six Nations. Wow. Big, big game against France coming up then at Twickenham again. So three home games in a row, which means we'd finish off against Ireland in Dublin. So that is certainly something to look forward to. But if we beat France, the Six Nations will all be on that final game. So big, big episode coming up. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Drop a like if you have. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of this series. And is there any mistakes I'm making? Um, yeah, always happy to hear what you guys have to say. And if you haven't already, please do move that subscribe button. I'll see you next time in the virtual scrum.